Learn with Eddie. Eddie, the pumpkins are ripe already. Eddie, where are you? Don't fool around, huh? <laughs> Eddie! Oh, there you are! <laughs> and wearing your unicorn costume for Halloween? Well, I was expecting something more terrifying. Uh -huh. I don't know, a werewolf, Frankenstein? I see, you like costumes that are a bit less scary. <laughs> <laughs> well, we are here today because we are going to make a decorative pumpkin for Halloween! <laughs> Eddie? <laughs> Is it? There you are. Come on, let's take the pumpkin to the workshop. Mm. Eddie? Is ah! it? Now you did scare me. <laughs> Ready to make your first Halloween pumpkin? <laughs> first, we have to cut off the top of the pumpkin. As if there was a lid. So we can take all that's inside out. <laughs> but hey, we're not wasting anything. We'll get it all in the blender to make some yummy pumpkin juice. Done! Now time to draw the typical Halloween horror face. Ooh. First, we'll draw the eyes like this. Scary eyes. Now, time for the nose. And last but not least, the mouth with some big, sharp teeth. Done, Eddie! Let's cut the pumpkin following the marks. And you kids at home already know the drill, right? Since we are using dangerous tools, always ask an adult for help. <laughs> One eye first, then the other, the nose now, and last, this big mouth full of teeth. And these pieces of pumpkin also go in the blender. We're not wasting anything. <laughs> One more thing, Eddie. Uh -huh. Let's put a candle inside the pumpkin. <laughs> Let's put the lid back on. And our Halloween pumpkin is ready. <laughs> Look what happens when we turn off the light, Eddie. Do you like it? I see you do. <laughs> I think you've earned a yummy pumpkin juice. <laughs> Happy Halloween, Eddie. <laughs> Hi, Eddie. You've got some cool look going on today. Uh -huh. I think I know what's happening here. Uh -huh. Halloween is right around the corner and you are making sure you've got everything you need, right? <laughs> hmm. The thing is, that box with stuff for Halloween is kind of old. Uh -huh. And that's why I've made you a new one. Where you'll be able to keep Whoa. all the new Halloween things. Uh -huh. We are going to go get at the supermarket. <laughs> I knew you'd love the idea. All right, Eddie. Off to an excursion to the supermarket. Look, Eddie. They've got all the Halloween decorations up. Let's see what we can find. But, Eddie, you've had your afternoon snack already. Twice! <laughs> Come on, where is the Halloween stuff alley, Eddie? <laughs> there it is, Eddie. Perfect! <laughs> there are paper buntings, pinwheels, and bats. Do you want us to get some of this? <laughs> Very good. Let's get a bit of everything. But not too much. <laughs> Let's see what else is there. <laughs> wow, so cool. There are lots of things here, oh. even spiders and skeletons. Mm -hmm. Don't be afraid, they are fake. <laughs> <laughs> you are funny. <laughs> Come on, we'll take one skeleton and some spiders. Great! They also have candles and decorative pumpkins. Do you want any of this, Eddie? <laughs> Only the candles? <laughs> oh, I see. You don't want to buy the decorative Halloween pumpkins because you want to make them yourself. <laughs> Great! So we've got a plan. 
decorating the house, and making our own Halloween pumpkin. <laughs> I see you are still trying on costumes for Halloween. <laughs> That's pretty cool, Eddie, but we still have time to decide on your costume. <laughs> because today, we are decorating the living room, so we add a gloomy feeling to it. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Let's use all the decorative elements we bought at the supermarket the other day. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be afraid. Mm -hmm. These are the paper bats you bought the other day. I didn't know they were going to come out like that. <laughs> it's part of Halloween, scaring and getting scared. <laughs> Do you want to put up more decorations? <laughs> we have some buntings here. They are not very scary, but they are decorative. <laughs> <laughs> Where can we put them? <laughs> <laughs> That's it. We'll hang them all around the room so it's full of color. <laughs> Have you realized they are black and orange? Oh. Halloween's colors. Black because imitating darkness and <laughs> orange imitating pumpkins. <laughs> Let's see what else is there in the box. Uh, spiders. Those I am afraid of. Where should we put them? Great. Let's use that as well. It'll be the scariest house of them all. <laughs> this just gets gloomier and gloomier. I wonder what will be coming out of the box uh. next. Mm. Wow, so cool, a skeleton. <laughs> Do you want to try that? You'll see. We'll hang uh. it from the ceiling. Mm. Uh, it looks almost real, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, this is going to be the spookiest Halloween in history. <laughs> what else is there for us to do? Yes, they are candles. Don't you get it? We can turn off all the lights and be left in the penumbra of the candles. Telling horror stories. We just need to put these Halloween pinwheels here. And that's all in the box. But we still need to put up the gloomiest thing of them all. The pumpkin you made. Do you remember? Do you want to see its effect? So cool. The decoration is fluorescent. Now we have the perfect atmosphere. Do you want to practice your scare tactics now? Hi, Eddie. Eddie? Are you there, Eddie? Mm. Ah! <sighs> you scared me, Eddie. Practicing for Halloween, are you? Well, you're quite good at it. Mm. But you should put on a costume so as to be scarier. Oh, you don't have a costume yet? And what are you waiting for? Let's open your wardrobe. I'm sure we can put something together. And what about you guys? What are you going to dress up as for Halloween? You can tell Eddie in the comments and give him ideas. Let's see. Let me have a look in your wardrobe. Got it! I made some changes to your princess dress and with a little more makeup, you could dress up as... A Katrina! Hmm, you don't know what a Katrina is, do you? <laughs> it's part of the Day of the Dead, a Mexican holiday that takes place right after Halloween. Uh -huh. They celebrate it in a very special way. It's really right. fun and colorful. It's amazing! <laughs> First, we have to put on your outfit. Where's your corset? <laughs> no, Eddie, that's the firefighter jacket. Uh -huh. Remember the corset? Like the one princesses wear? Well done! Oh, check out the bones! Isn't it cool? Your character is a skeleton! But a really fun skeleton, of course! You'll see! And for your bottoms... What should we pick? Really? Let's try it on! <laughs> you look really funny! But you're supposed to be scary, not funny! Yes! That's much better! You just need your accessories. Let me lend you a hand. For your feet, these black shoes that match your dress. And I have a special surprise. A flower crown. You weren't expecting that, were you? I told you this was a special skeleton. And there's one more surprise. We're going to make you up. First, the foundation. You're a skeleton. So what color should we use? White, of course. 
You need to be as pale as possible. And your eyes need to be dark. And your smile needs to be much more sinister. But I told you this was a fun skeleton, remember? So we're going to decorate you a little bit. Here, here, and here. Perfect, Eddie. You're a Katrina. <laughs> now you're ready to scare people. <laughs> Just not me, okay? What's the matter? Oh, I think the lights have gone out. <laughs> Eddie? Are you there, Eddie? <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Eddie? <laughs> what in the world are you doing? Why are you putting all those things inside the pot? It looks like you are making a witch's potion. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's what it is. Since you are dressed as a princess, I didn't get it. <laughs> Since you want to make potions, why don't we dress you up as a witch this Halloween? Uh -huh. <laughs> and you, guys, what do you want Eddie to dress up as? Let us know in the comments. <laughs> Come on! While I put out the fire and tidy up all this mess, you can go to your room. <laughs> Kitchen cleaned, Eddie. Ready to become a witch? Let's see what we've got in the closet. Hmm, which of these clothes do you think is the witch's costume? The mermaid tail? It doesn't really look like something a witch would wear. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good job, Eddie. You got it right this time. We have tights to choose from here. Look at the colors. I'm sure you'll get it right the first time. That's it, Eddie. You have chosen the perfect witch tights. Let's see what else we've got. Your shoes. <laughs> How do these boots fit in? I see you don't love them. <laughs> I think these shoes will be better. Look, here are the cloaks. Very good, Eddie. You got the hang of it. We are almost done. Look, Eddie, you have to choose something for your head. <laughs> you almost got it. Hmm. Uh -huh. Good job, Eddie. You got it right. <laughs> You've got some cool look going on today. <laughs> Here are the hats. Which do you think is the witch one? <laughs> That's it, Eddie. You got it right the <laughs> first time. <laughs> but we still need one last thing before we are done. Uh -huh. The <laughs> witch's broom. Uh -huh. Wow! And it's magical, Eddie! <laughs> Happy Halloween night, Eddie! <laughs> Hi, Eddie! You tried to scare me today, huh? What do you think about making some food for the Halloween party? Can you think of anything? Eddie, we are not doing Christmas cookies until a couple of months from now. Now, we have to think about... Did you hear that, Eddie? Uh -huh. Well, I'm sure it was just the wind. What do you think about mm, ghosts? Did you hear that just now? Uh -huh. Well, where were we? <laughs> That's it. First, we are going to make meringue ghosts. <laughs> it's so easy. We just need to squeeze the pastry bag while we spin it. This way, we'll get the ghosts. But before placing the eyes in the face, we need to put them in the oven. So we have some spare minutes to work on another recipe. Good job, Eddie. Great idea. We just need some black licorice and chocolate cookies. Ah, spiders. Oh, they are fake. <laughs> well, for this recipe, we just need cookies. A small jar with white chocolate balls and a little bit of black licorice. First, we'll separate the parts of the four cookies. Now some little pieces of licorice, eight for each spider. We put them in four of the cookies 
And now we just need to cover them again. And their legs are ready. Now, with some white chocolate balls, we'll make the eyes. And again with the licorice, we make the pupils. Eight total. Done! Have you heard that now, Eddie? It's that ghost or something like that again. Mm -hmm. We'd better hurry up. We need chocolate to decorate the eyes <laughs> and the mouth of the ghosts. Ah, bats! <laughs> <sighs> All right, it was the fake ones. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's add the chocolate and we are out of here, Eddie. We just need to draw carefully the eyes and the mouths. They can be different. That'll be more fun. <laughs> I am leaving. Eddie? Ah. Eddie! <laughs> it was you this whole time scaring me. <laughs> Without a doubt, you are definitely ready to scare everyone on Halloween. <laughs> Hi, Ed Eddie. Where are you? You want to scare me again, don't you? Got you! You're going to have to do better to catch me off guard. Well, tell me, is everything ready for your Halloween party? Your costume, the games, the balloons, the cake... You don't have a cake? Who's scared now, huh? Don't worry, I'll help you make one. Since it's a Halloween party, we could make... a pumpkin cake! What do you think? What about you guys? What kind of Halloween cake would you make? You can tell Eddie in the comments. It's very easy, Eddie. We just have to cut out the top and hollow out the pumpkin so that we can mix the filling with the dough. Do you remember what other ingredients we need for a cake? You love chocolate, don't you? That's fine, but we'll add it later. Think, what's the basic ingredient in bread and cake? That's it, Teddy! Flour! <laughs> what else? If we want it to be sweet, we'll need... Sugar! Well done! And we need something else. Something that comes from a feathered animal. No, Eddie, not ferrets. Feathered. I meant a chicken. Eggs, that's it! We'll use three. We mix everything together <laughs> and we wait for it to bake in the oven. In the meantime, we can carve the pumpkin. What do you say? <laughs> it's as easy as making three triangles for the eyes and nose and the mouth with teeth. Perfect! We have a Halloween pumpkin! What was that? Was it you? Uh -huh. Never mind, cake's ready! We have to be careful so as not to burn ourselves. You wanted to add chocolate, right, Eddie? Uh -huh. <laughs> Alright then, let's add two layers! <laughs> That's it! One in the middle... And another one on top! It looks amazing! <laughs> but it needs a creepy touch, something that says Halloween! Uh -huh. That's it! A cobweb! It'd be great if we also had chocolate spiders. We can make them out of biscuits. You have great ideas when it comes to chocolate, Eddie. These are perfect! And for the legs, chocolate shavings. And for the eyes, I have a surprise. Chocolate balls! Aren't they cool? I've been saving them for this. Check out this amazing cake! We make great pastry chefs! What are you doing, Eddie? Where are you going? You're not going to scare me, Eddie. I can see you coming. What is that? <laughs> Eddie, you've overdone yourself this time. Hi, Eddie! Do you know what we're going to do today? Uh -huh. Today you're going to pick your Halloween costume! <laughs> Are you excited, Eddie? <laughs> do you know who you're going to dress up as? <laughs> you haven't given it any thought, have you? 
Let's see what we have here. <laughs> Check out all these costumes, Eddie. Uh -huh. There's a vampire costume, mummy costume, a Frankenstein costume, and a pirate costume. Come on, pick one. What's the matter, Eddie? Don't you want to dress up as one of these characters? Huh? I don't understand, Eddie. Ah, see. You want to dress up as all of them, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> what a combination. <laughs> Let's see. You have to pick parts of the different costumes. Great choice, Eddie. A mummy suit for your body. Done. Let's see. And what about your head? Frankenstein's bold. Come on, let's put them on then. Don. Anything else, Eddie? <laughs> Whoa, Eddie! You picked the Dracula cape. That's so cool, Eddie! I'm liking more and more your idea of combining costumes. You're so original. <laughs> All right, Eddie. Do you want more stuff? The pirate hat and the eye patch. That's such a great idea. <laughs> now you are a true mummy vampire <laughs> pirate <laughs> Frankenstein. <laughs> Would you let me add the final touches? <laughs> Come on! Let's put on the vampire teeth and... We're done, Eddie! Now you're ready for Halloween! <laughs> and you guys, who will you dress up as for Halloween? Please, let us know in the comments! <laughs> See you on our next video! Hi, Eddie! What do you think of the picture we're going to color in today? Ha ha ha, don't be scared, Eddie. They're just the Halloween decorations. All right, Eddie, which one do you want to color in first? <laughs> Very well, so what's the color of pumpkins, Eddie? That's right, Eddie. Pumpkins are orange. <laughs> Let's color in the pumpkin then. Hey, Eddie, are you looking forward to Halloween? <laughs> That's great! We're going to have such a great time! <laughs> Alright, Eddie, so let's add the final touches in the color green. And done! <laughs> Aren't you excited? Which one do you want to color in next? <laughs> the bat! Ooh! And which color should we pick for the bat? Great choice, Eddie! I thought you got for the color black, but this way the bat will be all the more original. Well done, Eddie! We're finished with the color purple bat. We should color his eyes, shouldn't we? Yellow! This will be so scary with eyes in that color! <laughs> and we've finished the eyes! Done! Now there's only one thing left to color in. Let's see, Eddie! What color should we pick for the ghost? Oh, that's right! You can see him because he is a ghost! Hang on a second! There he is! Don't worry, Eddie! Don't be scared! It's just a picture! <laughs> it's alright, Eddie! I color him in the color gray myself! You had quite a scare, huh? <laughs> and we're finished! Now we have our Halloween decorations! And you guys, what do you like best about Halloween? Please let us know in the comments! We can't wait to find out! See you on our next video! Hello, Eddie! <laughs> That's a lot of burgers, isn't it? Mm -hmm. At least be careful with the ketchup. Uh. Don't squeeze it too hard. Mm -hmm. uh. Wow! What a mess! And I did tell you to be careful. <laughs> oh, what was that? <laughs> Eddie, you've gone too far this time. Uh -huh. You know perfectly well that eating so many hamburgers is not good for you. Oh. Even if they are vegetarian. <laughs> Plus, you didn't even listen to me when I warned you to be careful with the ketchup. <laughs> and as if that was not enough, you got sauce all over me as well. <laughs> I know you like having fun. I get it, but not at the expense of everyone else. Uh -huh. I admit sometimes you behave so well you look like an angel. <laughs> but in this case, oh. look. Eesh. It looks like the devil has gone through the kitchen. <laughs> All right, I think I know what's happening here. Hmm. Don't tell me you want to play angels and devils. <laughs> okay, but first, we'll tidy up the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, Eddie. Last, we will put the crime weapon away. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Now that you've taken responsibility for your actions, <laughs> we can play and dress up. <laughs> All right, Eddie. 
What do you want to turn into first, an angel or a devil? <laughs> hmm. If you dress up like a devil, do you promise you'll still behave? Mm. Great. Let's get down to business then. <laughs> first, the suit. <laughs> And you'll also need some tough shoes like these. <laughs> Let's see what we've got in the closet. Wow, these wings do look real. And with this hat, you'll look like a true devil. <laughs> but we are still missing the most important thing. Uh -huh. Yeah, Eddie, your costume can't be complete until you get <laughs> your trident. Uh-oh, uh -huh. I got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> Eddie, are you all right? Oh no, really? Now you are a true devil. <laughs> Eddie, no! Stop getting foam everywhere. Uh -huh. It's over. Let's put the car washing machine away and get rid of this uh -huh. trident that's got us into so much trouble. Uh -huh. Have a look around. Now, we'll have to work all day to get this room back to normal. What a disaster. Wait a minute. Do you think if we dress you up as an angel, we'll be able to fix this? Hmm. Doesn't sound like a bad idea. All right, let's give it a go. Hurry up. It's almost time for dinner, and we need to fix this mess. First, the dress. And now, these Whoa. cute golden shoes. Mm. Let's have a look at the accessories. These wings are so cool. <laughs> they look like they are made of gold. <laughs> and with this halo, <laughs> you'll be able to start acting like an angel. <laughs> but I think if we want to fix it all, we still need to give you something else. Uh -huh. If the trident turned you into a devil, maybe <laughs> this will turn you into an angel. <laughs> Yes, it worked! That's it, Eddie. You'll <laughs> fix it all as an angel. <laughs> now, you do deserve a good and healthy dinner. Uh -huh. Hamburgers again? <laughs> Great! Some pasta with veggies will be perfect. <laughs> Eddie? Oh my! What's happened here? I see. The birds have eaten the crops. Poor Eddie! He's going to be so upset when he sees this. Oh, hi, Eddie! Wait! Uh -huh. I was just about to tell you. Mm -hmm. The birds ate the crops, I'm sorry. Mm. Don't be cross, they're hungry too. Besides, we'll plant vegetables again and they'll grow in no time. <laughs> and we'll put up a scarecrow, so that this doesn't happen again. Uh -huh. <laughs> Don't you know what it is? <laughs> a scarecrow is like a dummy. Uh -huh. And when birds see it, They'll think it's a person and they'll leave. <laughs> of course, and we'll have a great time making it, you'll see. And you guys, will you also lend us a hand? <laughs> you can also give us ideas about what we can plant in the garden. Eddie reads all of your comments. <laughs> Here we go, Eddie. First, we'll need a frame that supports the dummy. Can you think of anything we can use? Uh -huh. Well thought, Eddie. These sticks will be perfect. First, we drive the longest stick in the ground. And now, we fasten the other stick perpendicularly. Now this is the basic frame for the dummy. Now it's time for the stuffing. We have to give it volume so that it looks like a person and fools the birds. That's it! We'll stuff it with straw. Wow, Eddie! You really are on fire today! <laughs> are you sure you've never done this before? Okay, a little bit more and... Done! This is the basic dummy! Huh? 
What is it? Uh -huh. Oh, right! I forgot about the head! <laughs> and what could we use? Oh, I got it! Hey, Eddie! Do you remember that old ball of yours? It got stuck on the roof! I think this is the perfect time to get it back! And use it as the scarecrow's head! What do you think? <laughs> You're not convinced, are you? How about now? Any better? Great! <laughs> now we just have to dress it like a person, so as to fool the birds. <laughs> we have to use colorful clothes that stand out. We could recycle some old clothes or clothes that don't fit anymore since we're at it, like this old school's mod. Or these Father <laughs> Christmas trousers, they won't fit anymore by the time Christmas comes around. <laughs> and this worn cowboy hat. <laughs> Don't worry, you have loads of other hats! <laughs> and our scarecrow is finished! <laughs> now we have to wait and see if it works! <laughs> we <laughs> did it! <laughs> I think you might have the opposite effect of scaring away birds, Eddie! <laughs> Si te ha gustado este video, no olvides darle a me gusta y suscribirte al canal. Ah, y también puedes hablar con Eddie escribiéndole a aprendeconedi.asubio.tv. Seguro que le encanta.